Hey guys, well, working on my uh, good buddy Austin's truck today. We're doing uh, valve springs and valve seals as well as a pyro install, but we're not doing that. His buddy Nick, Nick Nick's yeah. doing it. And then uh, he's gonna do some tires as well, so it's gonna be a busy day, but uh, we'll get right into it. Well, here's all the goodies we're gonna be installing today. We got our valve springs, uh, valve cover gaskets, and then I think, Right, let it go. There's a little bag of uh, the top part of the valve cover. So we'll get all these put in and then uh, maybe go rip some donuts or do a burnout or something. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. All right, so we got the top valve cover cover off <laughs> Austin and his pizza <laughs> and uh, we disconnected the fuel shut off solenoid and then we got uh, we got it pumped over um, basically what we're doing is we're going for top dead center on each piston so that we can not worry about dropping the, uh, the valves into the cylinder so uh, if the valves do wander down it's not gonna be a big deal they won't go far so now we'll uh, get this guy ripped off Get our handy dandy tool installed and uh, change some valves and seals. Well, we got number one cylinder all buttoned up, so now we're gonna go ahead and do number two. I just wanted to get the first one out of the way so I don't look like an idiot when uh, I run into a complication, because <laughs> it happened. It happened. Set that off to the side. Yeah, we're gonna have to bump the starter on this one. Austin's doing tires. <laughs> oh, yeah. Fresh rabbits. Yeah, 35s? Yeah. 35s, jeez. <laughs> Joy's working at a tire shop. We can do our own stuff on our own time, on our own dime. <laughs> yeah, I'll just wait till he's done. And then uh, we'll bump the starter. All right, we're getting ready to bump the starter. So you'll see these things move when he bumps it. I'll yell at him to stop, and uh, we'll be good. Again. Again. That. Oh, one more time. There we go. Perfect. That one's loose. That one's loose. We're good. Sweet. Right. Hi. Right, thank you. You're very welcome. <laughs> All right, now we got to pull the rocker pedestal off. So it's an 18 mil and 13 mil. And then uh, we use this rag to cover up the, uh, the push rod so nothing can fall in. I'm trying to keep my hands out of the way so you guys can see what I'm doing. And yes, this is one of the head bolts. So when you're pulling the rocker pedestal off, you're gonna to wanna to rock it back and forth so that it breaks the uh, oil tension on the push rods or you can just push the push rods down, but you don't wanna lift the push rods out, so. There, just like that. And time for the handy dandy tool. That goes in there. There's a little, uh, I guess, not recessed, opposite of recessed, raised? <laughs> little raised section that goes into your head stud hole there. That aligns it properly. Use your uh, little Allen head cap screw there. Tighten this guy down. We're just going to go hand tight on this one. That's all you need. 
And then because last time we had issues when I was pushing the, uh, the valve springs down, it was actually pushing the valves down as well. I'm just gonna give these guys a little, little tap just to free them up. Hopefully that will have been enough. If not, we'll just do it some more. <laughs> like they're wandering down so we're gonna have to give them a couple more love taps actually before I do any of that I'm going to put this rag right there there that one just popped that guy popped sinking. I don't think the front one did though. Yeah, I don't know if you guys can see that one hopping, but that might be why he's burning oil. I think this back exhaust uh, valve seal's done. It's not holding the valve at all. <laughs> Yeah. There we go, the other one popped. Hopefully that's all my smoke problem. Yeah. Should only smoke when you're romping on it. <laughs> it should only be black. Yeah. Blue is not so good. Alrighty. Now grab our handy dandy picking tool. I don't like this. I don't like how that valve keeps trying to fall. You stay up. Try to rotate the keepers out of the way so I can get a better angle of my screwdriver. And up you go. Perfect. Now we'll grab our little magnet guy. And uh, you kind of definitely want to put these keepers in a bag or something so they don't uh, don't disappear because they're very small parts. Try to pick that guy up and grab it. There we go. are nice and safe. So next step is unwind the tool. sure that the oil tension is broken on the bottom. You can see it's keeping this guy attached. <laughs> so don't want to drop that anywhere and have it disappear forever. Now valve springs can come out. We'll set these off to the side. Is there other rag to wipe our hands? Pull off the valve seals. Oh man, this one's just like disintegrated. Gross. 
Garbage. And uh, the pliers, I just have a very light grip on the, uh, the valve with them. I just, just a precaution. And uh, looks like a 12 mil. <laughs> just grabbing whatever I can find. And we'll just. Tap it to seat it. And that's all there is to it. We'll do the other one, and then we'll put the upgraded valve springs in. And uh, then the rocker pedestal and tighten everything to spec. And then we'll be good to go. That's so much more tread. All, I <laughs> All of the tread. That's weird, I can hear that out of the exhaust. <laughs> Do you hear that? I can hear it echoing back there. <laughs> Funky. Yeah, they bury the pipe in the ground and it's like 50 feet away and you can yell at people. Yeah. <laughs> That's awesome. valve springs are a little girthier than the factory ones so um, you'll have to guide them um, so that the uh, valves don't get pushed in it's so much better just had the 15 move. Starting to go through. Tighten it down. Oh, that one got caught. Come on up. Come on. Ah, you don't want to come. Magnet. Not even. If I can get the uh, valve spring down enough, then I can get underneath where the creeper seat. The 
Did I say creepers or keepers? I don't know. There we go. That'll work. Perfect. Oh, grab our keepers, put them back in place. Being very careful. And you'll notice the keepers, um, they've got a little ridge. Uh, tapered narrow side goes down. And then the top of the valve has got a little recess in it, and that's what uh, that little lip there rests on. So and make sure that your gloves are tight so that you can't slip. That goes in there. That guy goes in there. Just dropped a creeper. Creeper, it's not a creeper. <laughs> Gonna have to clean that guy up. Sounds like progress. Oh, yeah. <laughs> All right. Push the switch. Oh, I thought you got it. Nice. So pull the, pull the valve up, push the keepers down. Once they looks like they're kind of good, then just push the valve and you'll tell if it seats right away. And that looks good. Give it a tiny little Not hitting it hard by any stretch of the imagination. And wind her out. Those are compressed quite a bit because it was at the top here where we started, so that's so much better. And that's a set of valve seals and valve springs installed. Sweet. Um, next thing I'm going to do is put the rocker pedestal back on and do a valve set on these, but you guys have already seen me do a valve set, so it's uh, nothing different. So, back to the time lapse.
Well guys, running through the numbers. I'm on number six right now. I stopped recording when I hit five because you can't see anything anyways, but I wanted to show you guys something. Uh, look where the valve seals are. They're at the top of the valves. That's not sealing nothing. <laughs> That's hilarious. Right. So, the symptoms of that? Yeah. Lots of blue smoke. <laughs> yeah. That's hilarious. It's definitely an issue. Uh, that makes me very happy. Yeah, no, it's, <laughs> it's, it's, a, it's a good thing. It's good that we're doing this. Thank God. Get it in, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, back to work. Okay, she's all buttoned back up. All the valve springs and valve seals are installed. Do not forget your torque bar. <laughs> yeah, that uh, wasn't too bad. Though my knees hurt. That's not fun to kneel on. I need like pads or something for that, but uh, yeah, what, what do you think? I'm, I'm ready to drive this thing. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, maybe we should go for a rip around the block. Yeah. Yeah, go see what she does. Yeah, and new then, tires, new springs, new seals. Yeah. Oh yeah, didn't show them the tires. Yeah, like brand a, new. Good meat onto her. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> awesome. Right on? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Are you bud? <laughs> oh yeah. Well, oh, stickers. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. I, I think it's safe to say we cleaned her out. Yeah. <laughs> man, that is different. <laughs> My truck will catch yours now. Oh man, so. thank you so much. Yeah, man. You do great work. Thank you. <laughs> See you at your house. Yeah.